Samantha from SamanthaVegaMakeup.com and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a rapid review on this guy right here. Pretty excited to talk about it. It's the new Smashbox Priming Water Mist. This product retails for $32 and you can purchase this at Sephora, at Sephora.com, Impulse, I believe on Smashbox's website and Ulta. I'm assuming that it will be at Ulta as well. And for $32 you are getting... 3.9 fluid ounces which is 116 milliliters. This water is infused with electrolytes to prime by misting to create a sheerest canvas for makeup. It hydrates the skin for hours, revitalizes the complexion to boost radiance. So when I first heard about this I was a little skeptical because I mean really a priming water when you hear of priming you don't really hear of water and primer together so I was skeptical when I heard about this particular product and for 32 bucks it better be really good it really does feel lightweight on the skin I have used this a couple different ways I have used it to prime my skin before my makeup I've used it to hydrate my skin throughout doing my makeup and I've also used it as a lasting finishing spray to reset my makeup. And I find that it actually works best if you use it before you do your makeup and then after to seal everything in. That's when I find that I get the most priming benefits. Like this makeup I've had on since 7 a.m. and it is now, I want to say 11.30 yeah it is now 11 30 and i'm looking pretty good i love how flawless my skin looks and it really does help to settle any of the powdery powderiness that you may get from putting too much powder on the skin or anything of that nature so i'm really pleased with the way i'm looking at myself in the viewfinder but as you can see i'm really pleased with the way that this has been working i'm going to lay something on y'all heavy that I just recently realized and just found out. If you look at the ingredients on Max Charged Water Mist, you will see that they duplicate the exact same ingredients in the Smashbox Photo Finish Priming Water. And the Max Charged Water Spray has been around for way longer than this guy right here. So that was very interesting to me when I realized that <laughs> It's the exact same thing. Like when I say the ingredients are the same down to the very last ingredients and the max charge water I believe is $22. So it's a whole $10 less for pretty much the same exact thing. For prepping my skin and for setting my makeup, I really do like this. Will I repurchase this? That is the big question. I don't know if I'll repurchase these after they run out because I have access to the max mineralized charged water that's a whole ten dollars cheaper and they have the same ingredients I can't honestly say that I would go ahead and repurchase this but for what it's marketed for and for what it's worth I think it's a great product and it really does work it's all about personal preference and whether you think that the charged water works better or if the Smashbox photo finish primer works better but as far as this goes I really do like it and it really does work I can't fake that so I really like it a lot. If you have used this product or if you've even used the MAC Charge Water, please leave your comment down and tell me what you think. If you use both of these or one of them, let me know what you think and if you feel like they would work exactly the same way because they contain the exact same ingredients. I would love to hear other people's um, responses and ideas on this particular topic. So until my next video, I will talk to you guys later. Bye. So once I went ahead and primed my lid, I'm going in with their palette. I'm using the five color ombre palette and this is palette number four. I believe the shade is number four. And wow, you guys, this palette is super gorgeous. I really love the coloring selection that they chose for this palette. They go very well together. You can do a very natural to a very, very vampy or very dramatic look with this. So what I did was take